Hello everybody and thank you very much for watching. This is me, Mr. P, and in this video I'll show how you can output Samsung DeX from your Galaxy device to any Android device. Let's begin. I'm gonna use my Note 9, my Note 4, then I will use the USB Type-C hub. This is a QGIM USB Type-C hub. I'm using this hub without, with no particular reason. It's just basically one of the USB-C hubs I do have with me. And it's, I, I, that's the only one I found. Other ones, I don't know where, where they are. So it doesn't matter what kind of USB-C hub you're gonna use, as long as it's worth with your Galaxy device, that, that USB-C hub will be fine. Then I will use, I, I will power this USB-C hub via USB Type-C, just because I know that QGIM won't trigger DAX with my Note 9 if I'm not supplying the power. So that's in, so as you can see, this is power in. Next thing, what I will use is HDMI cable, just to pass the HDMI, uh, Samsung DAX signal out from USB Type-C hub. And then I'm gonna use this. This is HDMI capture card, HDMI video capture device. This is one of these made in China, very cheap you capture devices. This I can capture up to 1080p and they're claiming 60 frames per second or 60 hertz, but I am, it works fine with 10, 1080 at 30 hertz. Um, so that's what we're gonna use. So I'm gonna take this, connect to my HDMI cable. So far, that's how it looks, everything looks like. Then I'm gonna use OTG adapter, micro B to USB type A, because my Note 4 don't have USB type C. So I'm gonna use this instead. If you're gonna use a secondary Android device that supports um, USB type C, you can use one of these that arrive with your Galaxy phone. So once everything is connected, I actually need a stand to bring the phone closer to the camera for you to see, so that's where it's gonna go. Right, what you need to do next is to go into a Google Play Store and search for the USB Camera Connect. There is two versions of this app. There is a paid version and there is a free version. You can use the free version, obviously, with no problems, but free version will show you the ad when it's in a landscape mode. It's almost like a quarter of the screen or almost third of the screen will be covered by ad which is just pain in the ass to, to use them. So I decided to purchase the pro version just because uh, this app is amazing and I decided to support the developer. Plus, I don't like to have the ad across the screen. So I'm gonna put my phone somewhere here. So hopefully the camera can pick it up. So I'm gonna just plug the, my all this connected thing in. Oh yes, before doing that, I need to make sure that I have my Note 9 plugged in into USB-C Hub. So let's do that now. So that's plugged in. So my Note 9 is saying that the HDMI output has been connected. Great. So it means something is happening with the DeX and I'm going to bring my Note 4 into the picture and I'm just going to connect that in. So that's connected. Hopefully the screen will change. Let me try to bring the, the microphone closer. So as you can see, that's the, that is the uh, Samsung DeX. If I tap on the screen, it goes full screen. If I tap again, as you can see, it's just, sorry, it's, it goes into full screen tap again, goes to a settings. The video output is set up to go at 1920 by 1080p 60 hertz. That's what this app is set up to. And this capture uh, capture adapter, that's what it's allowing to do. If I'm gonna press Windows key, as you can see, I'm pressing the Windows key on the keyboard and app draw is opening up on the Note 4. And this is how I can use my Note 4 to act as a Samsung DeX display to be used with my Galaxy device. Next, let's try to do the same thing with my Galaxy Tab S6. Right now, I'm just gonna disconnect this. And uh, instead of using U micro B to USB type A, I'm gonna use the USB type C to USB type A, and I'm gonna use USB type C extender, just because I'm using a case with my Galaxy Tab S6, and the, the OTG adapter is not gonna reach the connector. So that's plugged in. So my Galaxy Tab goes this way. So right now, I'm just gonna go into home. And I'm just gonna plug in that into the uh, into the adapter going this way. That's plugged in. Okay, I'm gonna choose the app to be used with. And <laughs> this is a DeX coming from Note 9 and being displayed on my Galaxy Tab S6. Yes, Galaxy Tab S6 has its own DeX inside, etc. blah, blah, blah. But imagine you don't have a monitor, D M HDMI monitor. You don't have the a lab dock. You just need to use DeX. So instead of, let's say you going and buying a lab dock for $200, $300, why not buy, buying a cheap Android tablet that will run this app? And then you get yourself a HDMI capture device on Amazon or AliExpress or eBay. I'll leave a couple of links in the description below for you to go and check it out. It costs like 
I don't know how much I paid, like £20 I think I paid, £15, 15 British pounds I paid. It was cheap and I actually bought it, um, thinking to use it to record a uh, deck screen on using OBS and etc. Anyway, that's a different story for another video. But here we go, I'm using, the, and actually the performance of this, it's, it's like, um, it's not the best, but it is, it is usable, it is usable for this kind of uh, application, let's say where you want to um, just let's say your Note 9 screen is crashed, is cracked. Uh, your Galaxy device, your Galaxy phone screen is smashed, so you can't control your phone. So you have something like this. You connect. You go into my files. So let's click on my files, and I'm gonna go and start moving files around. So just to to be clear, if I go to settings and I scroll down to about the phone, here you go SM-N960F, my Note 9 phone, and that's not Galaxy Tab S6 because if I'm gonna minimize. This is a Galaxy tablet display, and this is the app I'm running, and this outputs Samsung DeX from Note 9 to my Galaxy tablet. <laughs> Amazing. Thank you much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comment section below what you think about this setup. Don't forget to subscribe to Samsung DeX subreddit group, and obviously subscribe to my channel as well. I would appreciate that. And I'll meet you in another video where I'm testing amazing things with the Samsung DeX. Thank you much for watching. Take care. Goodbye.